Hey everybody, the Bong is here. Welcome to yet another taste test video where I get to try something new for the first time. And lately we've had like the uh, spicy ramen noodles, Vietnamese sandwiches, and Filipino dumplings along with chicken adobo. So now we're taking a bit of a downgrade with a flaming Hot Cheeto Mac and Cheese. I left the box over there in the kitchen, but so that's what it looks like. I might have used too much milk when I was like mixing it together, so it looks very soupy. But I've had Flaming Hot Cheetos before and Flaming Hot Cheetos Mountain Dew. So maybe this one will be a little bit spicier and might actually be edible. Some people are saying it's actually not that bad, but I have my doubts. So, here we go. Oh yeah. Oh, it's spicy, alright. It's pretty, pretty damning on your tongue as soon as it hits it. But it tastes okay. It's, it's very salty. Like, it, it, let's be honest. It, it's box mac and cheese. Of course it's going to be salty. Like, this would be like a once in a while kind of thing. I would not recommend you have this every month. Or every week, especially. Like, if I ever get this again, I got to use less milk. Because, I mean, look, I definitely use too much. Like, when I was mixing it, it looked pink. You know what it remind me of? Uh, Kraft Dinner actually had something called Cotton Candy Mac and Cheese. And I never tried it. It was, like, way before I even did this series on YouTube. Honestly, I regret not picking it up because that would have made for some absurdity right there. Alright, let me take one last spoonful. In case anyone asks, like, is it really that spicy? It is spicy, but it's not the hottest thing I've ever had. The Korean noodles, like, even the cheese one was way spicier than this. This has a little bit of an aftertaste to it, but it's not too offensive. The only other kind of Cheeto mac and cheese that I've had was, like, the uh, bowl cheesy one. I know they had another one that was, like, jalapeno, and I'm like, why do you have two different kinds of spicy... Cheetos mac and cheese. You got jalapeno, and you also got flaming hot. Like, couldn't you just done like the um, maybe the nacho kind or the pizza roni or like pizza paws kind? Actually, I think the orange one was like nacho cheese. I don't remember, but that one like had a weird aftertaste to it compared to this one. So would I recommend it, like, maybe as an indulgence, but don't have it every once in a while. Like, your your body will hate you for it. So I'm just going to keep this short and sweet, and uh, I guess I'll see you guys for the next one.